welcome back to another photo vlog. Today, I'm trying a new exercise. I'm coming to the city center of Aix-en-Provence, which is my hometown. And I'm gonna be trying to take some photography of my hometown, which if you're a photographer, you know, trying to be inspired to take photos when you're very familiar with your surroundings is not easy. It's not the easiest of exercise, but today I just got uh, Sam back from the US. Sam is my wife. She was in LA for three weeks, so now she's back and she's gonna be able to help me out with my video. She's gonna be able to help me film this and uh, I'm gonna attempt to take photos of my hometown. Let's see how it goes. As far as the gear goes, I'm shooting this video on the Fujifilm X-T4 with the 18 to 55 mil uh, lens on it, f2.8, uh, and I'm taking photos with the Fujifilm X-T3 with the 16 to 55 mil f4, and I'm also going to be taking photos on the Fujifilm X-T4, so it's going to be a little bit of both. Now we are here bright and early because Sam is completely jet lagged. She just got home last night from Los Angeles and we went to bed at 9 and at 4 a.m. Couldn't sleep anymore. And also last night was the night we actually switched back the clocks for winter time. So we've been up for four hours. It is now 8 or 9 a.m. and the streets are empty. I also wanted to come on the Sunday morning because that's when the least people are out and that's the kind of vibes I wanted to get from X. So, so far so good. Everything is empty just like I like it. As I mentioned earlier, Aix-en-Provence is my hometown. That's where I was born 30-something years ago. And Aix-en-Provence is uh, located in the south of France, uh, in the region of Provence. And mostly here, everything you find in architecture is stone-based and it's very similar to uh, Italy with lots of colors and, you know, that's the kind of vibe you get. Obviously, it's very different from all the videos I've done so far, but hopefully you like the town and the way things look. If you actually do like the vibes of the south of France, you should check out uh, Sam's channel. I'll link it in the description. She actually does a lot of videos about life in the south of France and life in Aix-en-Provence. So if you like the town, definitely check her out because she has tons of content that's showing that off. So let's keep on going and see what shots we can get.
that was just the uh, market square got a little crowded not the vibes i was going for but now we're heading to the coffee shop but i love that about the market is when there's people it's nice to get photos and see it lively i love it i've missed the market so much I highly recommend Mana if you're ever in Aix-en-Provence. This is the best place to get coffee. And this is this is the third coffee of the day, by the way. If you don't know, I love coffee. Alright, today's exercise shooting in my hometown was very, very hard. Uh, very hard to find inspiration for photos and for videos. But it's a good exercise and uh, I encourage everyone to actually try and do that. I remember like when I first got back to Aix-en-Provence when I was living in LA for the last nine years. That was like three years ago. And I first came back here, I was very, very inspired, I guess, because it was just a change of scenery. And Sam, who just got back from LA for three weeks, already got very inspired. So it really is a question of a habit. But my, my vibes, the things I really like is to shoot in um, big, big cities, kind of like Los Angeles. But unfortunately, when I got into photography too late, like maybe a couple of months before I actually left Los Angeles, I got into photography. So I only got to go out and shoot once there. And then this is the kind of small town vibes I've been used to ever since. But on that note, um, we're planning some travels before the end of the year and we're going back to a big city. Now that's been a dream of mine for the last maybe 15 years or so. We are actually going to Japan, Tokyo, for quite a few days. So I'm very, very excited about that. And I'm going to be doing, I guess, a bunch of vlogs and shoot some content there and a lot of photography. So I am stoked. Want to add something? I can't believe that we're actually going because this has been like Paul's childhood dream. So it's very, very exciting. I'm super excited for him. We've been wanting to go, but like it's been closed. It's and been then... closed for the last three years ever since COVID hit and it just reopened maybe, maybe like three weeks ago. I came home last night from Los Angeles and this morning I was up at 3 a.m. because of jet lag. And so he ended up getting up with me and then we were like, let's plan a trip. And we booked, he booked our tickets. The ticket. <laughs> and I was like, is this a dream? It was so sudden. Yeah, and, unreal. Yeah. Very, very excited. I can't wait. <laughs> I know. All right, anyways, this is it for today's uh, photo vlog. I hope you liked it. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed to the channel, please do so for more videos like this. And uh, I guess I'll see you guys next week for another video. Cheers.